Chris and Anthony are back with another classic NES game. And guess what? We just played Bad Dudes, so now we're totally bad dudes. That's right, Chris. We're going to kick some ass in the next game that we pick. Are we going to chew bubblegum? We're going to not chew bubblegum because I didn't bring any. So I guess you could say I'm all out of gum. <laughs> 359. Today we are playing. Surprisingly, that actually wasn't rehearsed and no fucking way. Lemmings! A good classic which I thought was on the Super Nintendo, but apparently is also on the NES. It is on the Super Nintendo. But Shit, another RTS. Kind of. This one's very simple. It's it's nowhere near as complicated as... Uh, Megalomania. Ogre, Megalomania or Ogre Battle. Well, uh, Megalomania wasn't really complicated as much as it was cryptic. Developed by Ocean Software. And wow, doesn't this look like it's right out of a 1980s uh, fever dream. It's like that's the ty type of cartoons you would see. Is the Joker. <laughs> it's a little bit, right? <laughs> if he was uh, one foot tall. That's right, Batman. It's me, the Joker. And now you're stuck in a world where there's nothing but me. <laughs> Interesting choice going with the Mark Hamill Joker. Uh, he is the Joker. Really? Not Heath Ledger? Not Nack, J Nack Jickelson. <laughs> You're <laughs> <some> dyslexic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit, yeah. All right, let's start playing. All right, so start. Just dig. Just dig. I'm going to let you play this. Do you know how to play Lemmings? We played it once, I think right? we played it once, but... Um... So basically, for those of you who are uncultured and don't know how to play Lemmings, these are the Lemmings, these little pixels, these 10-pixel blobs. Um, and what you do is you control a giant cursor because you are their god and you select one of them to perform a certain task. So uh, on the bottom you'll see your options. What about L and R? Oh, wait, NES didn't have L and R. Right. Uh, select? The select button? No. Huh? Can you like literally click on them with your cursor? Does the cursor go down that far? Stop hitting start. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I think I have to hit start. Game pause? No. Okay, I can't issue commands while the game is paused. But oh, they're doing something. Oh, I think you hit self destruct. Oh no! Oh no! Well, it's not as violent in the NES version. In the Super Nintendo version, they all, like, combust. Uh huh. Rock bottom. I hope for your sake that you nuked that. <laughs> Why is Duke Nukem in every one of our episodes? <laughs> it's get He's becoming more famous than Star Fox references. Uh, here they are, here are the lemmings! This is like uh, in the dump right next to where E.T. was buried. <laughs> Just dumping them right in. Alright, look, you did something. How'd you select? I hit Y while hold. I mean, B. Oh, it, yeah, there's probably a multi button thing, because it's. I don't know, man. This is weird. I can't even make out. Okay, this is the umbrella. Or, no, this is the digging. This is digging. So hit one of them while selecting digging, and that should make them start digging. Alright, see if I can. No, just no, just tap A and B. Keep mashing it. Nope, you did something. You 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 are moving too far. We need to go back to dig. There you go. That's not it. That's um that's okay. I figured it out. Or maybe dig is this one. You might have to do the the pickaxe. Yeah. Now tell tell him to start digging. Yeah, I don't know how. To, the problem is, is I don't know how to issue the command. Hmm. It, it should be simple. It should just be one button, right? Yeah, it's not gonna be uh, these two. Look. Oh wait, hold on. Let me try this. These two are turbo. Huh? <laughs> these two are turbo buttons. These are the only two buttons. Oh, okay. <laughs> that reduces the complexity, but still. <laughs> Is this like copywritten music? Cause I know this song. It's classical, right? Uh, yeah, it's classical. I think it's French. Remember how I said, you know, this wasn't cryptic, like megalomania? Uh, what? Uh, oh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes. Okay, so there's ten here. That's the walking command. Okay. Oh, you did, you did it! You did it, that's digging. You win. That's simple. So you dig a hole, they walk to the left, hopefully they don't fall off the edge here. Okay, good. Wait, what happened to the other ones? They, uh, they fell to their deaths. How? Good question. How did he live? I don't know. I don't care. <laughs> How do you, would you not care? Spot on. Who cares about the nine that died? Level only two, only fl something. 
Oh, I like this music. All right. Oh, God. oh you gotta set them for umbrella mode. This one right here. Pause it. <laughs> They're about to splat. Oh, that's what you should have did in the other level. You should have set them for umbrella mode so they didn't take fall damage and liquefy their bones and muscles. <laughs> well, if this game has taught us anything, one survivor is enough. Okay. I Pretty cool, I, right? I, I think I figured out how to... I think I figured out how to issue commands. You totally stormed that level, but can you complete the next one? Can See, they're made for, for more blocks. Alright. What is this? Oh, this one you're gonna have to use the, um... This command here, the blocking one. Hurry. I'm trying to figure out how to get that far! Maybe you can pause the game and select. Or you're gonna lose... Well, no, you could still win. You only have to save one of them. But you're gonna need this one. This stops them from walking in one direction. Actually, no, you're probably screwed. <laughs> there you go. I don't think you have enough guys to survive here. Actually, you, you do, but it's gonna be very difficult. It's like some Mario Paint style music here, isn't it? Okay, I think I'm, I think I'm getting this. Yeah, you're gonna have to take the guy on the top after that and bring him down. Actually, you probably need to make him go to... No, you can do this. Here, and then the umbrella will bring him down. So yeah, this is like a puzzle game, kind of. No, I, I get it. It would just be easier if I knew what the... Like, how to control it better, I guess? Yeah, again, it doesn't help that the NES only has uh, two, control two buttons on the controller for input. Aside from start and select. Uh... Okay, so that's the pause. I think you need to hit this. Whatever that is. Or you, you probably can just take this guy. Look at that hair. Look at those hair physics right there. Alright, you know, fuck it. They're tapping. Fuck their, it. Fuck they're they're fuck tapping it. their feet impatiently. Who do you think you are, Sonic the Hedgehog? I commissioned you <laughs> all to death! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, they actually destroy the, the platform, too. I guess it wouldn't matter if they all die. It wouldn't help you. Get ready. Stop the first one. Okay, I figured it out. Yes. We're now we're unstoppable. Yep, I've got it. I know how to play now. I got it. I got it. We're good. We're good. Now, do you know why they call them lemmings? Um, no. Because they all follow each other. And if the first one walks off a cliff, guess what? All the other ones behind them are going to do the same thing. Which, which reminds me, because lemmings are, you know, the animal that are, you know, historically... Well, like, it's it's like the popular cultural reference to say, Oh, you're a lemming. You're just gonna go, you know, walk off the cliff or follow somebody else down a path of destruction. So the little animals surge forward. Their frenzy takes them tumbling down the terraced cliffs, creating tiny avalanches of sliding soil and rocks, and seemingly indestructible lemmings. Do you think you need umbrellas there? No. Oh, stop him, stop him! Oh, saved! Yeah, so, uh... You just let them survive, and then all the people that... Well, I don't know how to make them start moving again. You I can think... try to figure it out. I mean, try this one. Is it? No? I don't know. Try all the options. Umbrella might work, because that just tells them to, uh, fall slowly. You know? No? No, I, I think that you that once they have been given a command... What about the movement? It seems like the footprints are a movement command. No, it just pauses the game. Oh, really? See? Not this one. Yeah, I guess screw them. I commissioned you all to death! Cyanide pills <clears throat> activated. <laughs> Goodbye. All right, you totally stormed that level. What can you do next? You need five. Okay, you're good. Uh, you gotta read what the level says for the clue. I, no, the color scheme in this is ass. Oh, we're gonna have to mine through that, I think. On the right side, not the left side. Otherwise, you're going into that pit of uh, swamp water. 
Hopefully they stop mining when they get to the bottom. Keep your eye on that idiot. Yeah, you're good. Now what? Where's the exit here? That's a good question. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, is there this anything? Looks like this looks like some sort of explosion thingy. Yeah, I don't know what they're doing. They're like, they're going to another dimension where lemmings take the place of humans in society. Oh, they're climbing. I think oh. that's it. I think the, yeah, the exit is on top of that thing. It's like they're all procreating up there. Huh. Just like <laughs> Megalomania. Oh. Yeah, true. I bet Megalomania was inspired by this game a little bit. Maybe a little bit. A little bit. I mean, it depends. What I, This came out first, I guess, yeah. Yeah. Pretty cool. Alright, so we got through episode one. We're doing much better in this NES game than the previous one. Yeah, I'm actually having, I'm having some fun here. So uh, we'll catch you guys next time on Retro Roulette.